Number one. Do you want to meet the client today or tomorrow? A. I am supposed to meet her at the Blue Moon restaurant. B. How about tomorrow? C. Yes, I will meet him. Do you want to meet the client today or tomorrow? A. I am supposed to meet her at the Blue Moon restaurant. B. How about tomorrow? C. Yes, I will meet him. Do you want to meet the client today or tomorrow? A. I am supposed to meet her at the Blue Moon restaurant. B. How about tomorrow? C. Yes, I will meet him. Do you want to meet the client today or tomorrow? A. I am supposed to meet her at the Blue Moon restaurant. B. How about tomorrow? C. Yes, I will meet him. Do you want to meet the client today or tomorrow? A. I am supposed to meet her at the Blue Moon restaurant. B. How about tomorrow? C. Yes, I will meet him. Number two. Didn't you call the help desk for the repair visit? A. No, you don't need to visit him. B. Yes, I am expecting the repairman at 3 p.m. C. Yes, the desk is mine. Didn't you call the help desk for the repair visit? A. No, you don't need to visit him. B. Yes. I am expecting the repairman at 3 p.m. C. Yes, the desk is mine. Didn't you call the help desk for the repair visit? A. No, you don't need to visit him. B. Yes, I am expecting the repairman at 3 p.m. C. Yes, the desk is mine. Didn't you call the help desk for the repair visit? A. No, you don't need to visit him. B. Yes, I am expecting the repairman at 3 p.m. C. Yes, the desk is mine. Didn't you call the help desk for the repair visit? A. No, you don't need to visit him. B. Yes, I am expecting the repairman at 3 p.m. C. Yes, the desk is mine. Number three, has John signed the contract or is he still checking the terms? A. Yes, she already sent the contract. B. I heard he accepted all the conditions. C. He was talking about the long-term parking. Has John signed the contract or is he still checking the terms? A. Yes, she already sent the contract. B. I heard he accepted all the conditions. C. He was talking about the long-term parking. Has John signed the contract or is he still checking the terms? A. Yes, she already sent the contract. B. I heard he accepted all the conditions. C. He was talking about the long-term parking. Has John signed the contract or is he still checking the terms? A. Yes, she already sent the contract. B. I heard he accepted all the conditions. C. He was talking about the long-term parking. Has John signed the contract or is he still checking the terms? A. Yes, she already sent the contract. B. I heard he accepted all the conditions. C. He was talking about the long-term parking.
Number four. Mr. White is the new owner of the company, isn't he? A. He was accompanied by two people. B. Yes, I think he is. C. No, he owns a huge building. Mr. White is the new owner of the company, isn't he? A. He was accompanied by two people. B. Yes, I think he is. C. No, he owns a huge building. Mr. White is the new owner of the company, isn't he? A. He was accompanied by two people. B. Yes, I think he is. C. No, he owns a huge building. Mr. White is the new owner of the company, isn't he? A. He was accompanied by two people. B. Yes, I think he is. C. No, he owns a huge building. Mr. White is the new owner of the company, isn't he? A. He was accompanied by two people. B. Yes, I think he is. C. No, he owns a huge building. Number five. Will you buy or rent the house? A. Rents are rising every month. B. We decided to purchase it. C. You can rent it any time. Will you buy or rent the house? A. Rents are rising every month. B. We decided to purchase it. C. You can rent it any time. Will you buy or rent the house? A. Rents are rising every month. B. We decided to purchase it. C. You can rent it any time. Will you buy or rent the house? A. Rents are rising every month. B. We decided to purchase it. C. You can rent it any time. Will you buy or rent the house? A. Rents are rising every month. B. We decided to purchase it. C. You can rent it any time. Number six. Shouldn't you bring an umbrella with you? A. It's been raining all day long. B. The weather is very humid. C. Oh, thanks. I forgot. Shouldn't you bring an umbrella with you? A. It's been raining all day long. B. The weather is very humid. C. Oh, thanks. I forgot. Shouldn't you bring an umbrella with you? A. It's been raining all day long. B. The weather is very humid. C. Oh, thanks. I forgot. Shouldn't you bring an umbrella with you? A. It's been raining all day long. B. The weather is very humid. C. Oh, thanks. I forgot. Shouldn't you bring an umbrella with you? A. It's been raining all day long. B. The weather is very humid. C. Oh, thanks. I forgot. Number seven. Do you want to meet Saturday or Sunday? A. Because I'm very busy every weekend. B. Yes, we meet every weekend. C. Sunday sounds better. Do you want to meet Saturday or Sunday? A.
because I'm very busy every weekend. B. Yes, we meet every weekend. C. Sunday sounds better. Do you want to meet Saturday or Sunday? A. Because I'm very busy every weekend. B. Yes, we meet every weekend. C. Sunday sounds better. Do you want to meet Saturday or Sunday? A. Because I'm very busy every weekend. B. Yes, we meet every weekend. C. Sunday sounds better. Do you want to meet Saturday or Sunday? A. Because I'm very busy every weekend. B. Yes, we meet every weekend. C. Sunday sounds better. Number eight. The board members approved your proposal, didn't they? A. I'm still waiting for it. B. Yes, they are in the boardroom. C. No, you have the wrong number. The board members approved your proposal, didn't they? A. I'm still waiting for it. B. Yes, they are in the boardroom. C. No, you have the wrong number. The board members approved your proposal, didn't they? A. I'm still waiting for it. B. Yes, they are in the boardroom. C. No, you have the wrong number. The board members approved your proposal, didn't they? A. I'm still waiting for it. B. Yes, they are in the boardroom. C. No, you have the wrong number. The board members approved your proposal, didn't they? A. I'm still waiting for it. B. Yes, they are in the boardroom. C. No, you have the wrong number. Number nine. Is the problem with the hardware or in the software? A. I think it's a flaw in the program. B. The work is very hard here. C. Neither do I. Is the problem with the hardware or in the software? A. I think it's a flaw in the program. B. The work is very hard here. C. Neither do I. Is the problem with the hardware or in the software? A. I think it's a flaw in the program. B. The work is very hard here. C. Neither do I. Is the problem with the hardware or in the software? A. I think it's a flaw in the program. B. The work is very hard here. C. Neither do I. Is the problem with the hardware or in the software? A. I think it's a flaw in the program. B. The work is very hard here. C. Neither do I. Is the problem with the hardware or in the software? A. I think it's a flaw in the program. B. The work is very hard here. C. Neither do I. Number ten. You've chosen some candidates to interview for the position, haven't you? A. I've applied for the job. B. None of them looks promising. C. I should come in for an interview tomorrow. You've chosen some candidates to interview for the position, haven't you? A. I've applied for the job. B. None of them looks promising. C. I should come in for an interview tomorrow. You've chosen some candidates to interview for the position, haven't you? A. I've applied for the job. B. None of them looks promising.
C. I should come in for an interview tomorrow. You've chosen some candidates to interview for the position, haven't you? A. I have applied for the job. B. None of them looks promising. C. I should come in for an interview tomorrow. You've chosen some candidates to interview for the position, haven't you? A. I have applied for the job. B. None of them looks promising. C. I should come in for an interview tomorrow.